Ladies and gentlemen, Shokano presents three female rounds in an amateur mixed martial arts lightweight contest. Introducing first in the blue corner, making his debut, weighing in at 153 pounds, representing King's Muay Thai, fighting out of Froome, Daniel Newman! And his opponent in the red corner with a record of one defeat. Weighing in at 152.2 pounds. Representing Jim O1, fighting out of Portsmouth, Tom Tornado T. Lightweight action here now in the shock and awe cage. Tom Day from Jim O1 in the red corner. His opponent, Daniel Newman from Kings Muay Thai in the blue. Ready. Ready. Wow, fast and furious from Newman. Newman's looking to take this one down to the ground straight away with the Gracie Baja shorts. Let's go, Dan. Let's go. He's got the underhook here so he can command the back control as well as command the top position if it goes down to the floor. Yeah, that's right. I mean, he can he can go either way, really. Nice work from Day, though, to utilize the underhooks here now on the outside position. If he can cl clasp the hands together, he can start to work the takedown. Goes for the knee to the body. Yeah, good knee from Day. Comes a battle of the underhooks here now up against the cage. Numa looking for the lift. Nice to the back. Daniel Newman looking for the back control. 
secures the take now looking for one hook got to be careful about allowing his opponent to get back to his feet nice trip from Newman Newman dragging this one back down to the ground and then mixing in the uh, ground and pound yeah Dave's got to be careful here his corner's shouting for no hooks oh, it looks like the chokes so he's going for the choke can't quite see but he's setting it up Oh, the arms underneath the neck here now. Looking to secure the rear naked choke. Oh, that's excellent work from Day. Yeah, two on one control. Both hands clasped though. From Newman looking for the takedown. Might opt to go and circle off to his uh, right side. He could opt for the lift as well. Nice disengagement there from Tom. Need to knee though. Yeah. He's got to be careful that he doesn't give his back again in these exchanges. Nice uppercuts there through the center line. Day looking for the body kick. Got to be careful about giving the leg though. Almost certain that Newman wants to take this one down to the nice. ground. Oh, beautiful reversal from Day. Very nice, yeah. All very good timing. Straight to the mount here now. Newman's looking to kick off the cage. Oh, nice from Day. Day looking to pour on the pressure. It gives the escape away to Newman. Great action. Get set for a second round here. Shock and all 34. Day in the red. Newman in the blue. Make sure you tag us in your stories. Hashtag SNA34. Oh, big shot again. Seems like Newman's really hungry for this takedown. Newman drops down for the leg here. Got to get the head and the arms lower than the opponent's always got to fight the right underhook currently of day that's the key for day to be able to turn into his opponent now here well i kind of like he wants to face him uses the cage to walk up yeah and using like a um, two on one arm drag position to get up as well which is good day with the overhook he looked for the hip toss before previously in this position Oh, that's nice, clean work. Newman now looking to get this top position, straight to mount. Looking for the ground and pound. Yeah, great body lock. Defensive work here from Tom Day, looking to chase the half guard in that bottom position. Gets it. Got to class the legs, though. Yeah, see if Day can get, get an underhook here, maybe try and work his hips out to the right side. Newman in this top position, he's got to be careful of the underhook though. He's got to address the right underhook of Day, otherwise he risks the back take. Day can free his head. He could have had the back there, but Day going back to the full guard position. Newman's response there was trying to turn into his opponent, which prompted Day to pull full guard. Day looks like he's walking up for the triangle here. Yeah, looking for the triangle. I mean, he did well to get his guard back there. He, he, he's just got to be really careful he doesn't give his back. Newman looked da dangerous before. Oh, he's, he's given it. 
It's like the arms underneath the chin. The right arm here of Newman. Nice defensive work from Day, though, fighting the grips, defending the neck. He's got just under a minute to work here. Does Newman in this back position. Now with the body triangle. Yeah, Tom's doing, doing the right things, being patient. He's got to fight the hands, continually fight the hands. Oh, Newman looking to sneak it behind the neck. There's nice defensive work, though, from Day. Yeah, I mean, just when it looks like he's, he's got him, he's two on one and then he's moving. Excellent work. Excellent work from Day. An educated crowd here at the Guild Hall in Portsmouth. Day taking advantage of the fact that Newman crossed the feet. But now Newman finding himself eating some heavy hammer fists from that top position from Day. Yeah, nice way to finish the round for Day. Always going to be careful of the triangle, though. <laughs> Newman potentially switching to the armbar there, but runs out of time. An interesting back and forth battle between these two here. The sweeps, the positional control up against the cage, the fight for that top position, and also fight for the takedown. Yeah, and, and Newman showing a bit of his guard right at the end there. I mean, he's, he's dangerous. He looks dangerous off his back. Didn't quite have the time to to finish it, but um, but yeah, excellent work. I'm impressed with Day's back defense, though. I mean, he could have panicked in that position. I mean, it's the second time that he was in it, but he could have panicked, but he didn't. You know, fighting the hands, fighting the hands, and when you get the opportunity, turning and getting on top. Get set for our third and final round for the lightweights. Day in the red, Newman in the blue. And a sense of urgency in both corners from these athletes. Let's see who can pull the trick first. Oh, Day going in with the flying front kick. <laughs> Newman looking for the reversal here. Newman's job is to try and circle his back away from this cage. The second he loses that arm, they can shoot for the takedown. Nice sprawl. Newman looking for the back here. I mean, Newman knows what he wants, doesn't he? He just, he just wants to get that takedown. Newman doing a, good, doing a good job of driving the hips towards, sitting on the cage to try and turn to get that outside position. He's gonna, gonna get a takedown of his own. Nice reversal. And now he goes for one, yeah. It'd be huge if he can complete it. Might look to bump the hips away from the cage and drag the legs towards the center. Yeah. Switches to the single. Yeah, single, he can go high crotch. I think a takedown here would be, would be great for Dave. Nice knee shield defense there. Newman separation looks for the guillotine potentially switches to the double unhooks big knee from day yeah I think Newman looks to be slowing a little bit I mean he's been really aggressive so far he's done a great job of coming forwards possibly might have spent a little bit oh Newman takes the back here Immediately looking to fight the neck, but he's got to get the hooks first. It's always position before submission. If he gets the hooks, he's got to try and stay low on the belt line as well, for fear of getting shaken off. He used strikes to try and hide the, the rear naked choke. Nice work. You can see there, Day looking for the escape to get the hips to the sky. But the body triangle switched to Newman and negated that. Trying to cover the mouth here. Yeah, I mean, Newman's doing great. This is exactly where he wants to be. And now he's gone mount. Keep those arms in. Keep those arms in. 
They potentially look at the chase of leg here. Yeah. Might use it to get the separation. I like that they didn't stop there. He popped his hips up and tried to, try to go for something straight away. Nice strikes, 10 seconds in round three. Roll through from Day, oh, looking for that nice. top position. Nice sweep from Day. He's looking to get mount here, Colin. Nice. Bat and forth battle, battle for positional control, both on the feet and on the ground between the two. And this one will go to the judges' scorecards. Yeah, great clash of styles. Um, impressed by both, you know, really good stuff. Results are in, and we hand it over to our MC, Mr. Ricky Wright. Hands at the free rounds of action. We go to the judges' scorecards who scored about 29-28, 30-27, and 29-28. All three in favor of your winner by unanimous decision. In the blue corner, Daniel Newman!